apparent, very apparent, that I'm looking a little bit of mess right now. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. It's apparent, very apparent, that I'm looking a little bit of mess right now. And that is because I am about to get ready because I'm going out to dinner with my parents and we're going to this really nice restaurant. So I thought that I would just like get glammed up and show you guys the process. I don't know if that's even something you're interested in seeing, but we're going to do it. Also, don't even know if this video will see the light of day, but you know what? We're going to record. We're going to get all cute and glam and it's going to be a great time. I think I'm just gonna straighten my hair because, did you hear my shoulder first of all? That was my shoulder. But I need to do something with this hair and I feel like I'm just in the mood to straighten it. So we might throw on a red lip, we might throw on some false lashes if we're feeling crazy. I guess we'll see. I figure we should do like a little before and after glow up transformation. So here is the before, clearly not ready to go to dinner wouldn't want to be seen out in public with my hair looking like this, but you know what? We're still fabulous and we're working it. So, before. First of all, I have very quickly realized how pale I have become in such a short amount of time. Secondly, this concealer is way too light for me. For all those makeup people watching this, please don't comment because I am not a makeup guru. I'm trying my best and <laughs> I definitely could improve my skills but I just I don't have the motivation to put like loads of makeup on every day to practice. Just keep that in mind. Um, I'm going to bronze the hell out of my face because I look like a ghost right now. I felt like I was gonna you know just play music but I feel like I want to do like a chit chat get ready with me instead. I just feel like that's more fun. The bags under my eyes are designer, baby. Any skincare tips or recommendations you have, plug them, baby, plug them. First order of business to talk about. I just updated my phone today to iOS 14 with like all the cool widgets and stuff, which is great, but for some reason, it now disconnected from my watch and I don't know why. Like, for some reason, my phone updated totally fine, not an issue. But the issue comes in now when my watch, like, isn't synced up. And I, like, it has nothing to do with the watch. And I don't know what's going on. And I'm quite aggravated. So now I'm trying to resync them so that they're, like, you know, going hand in hand as they should. But it's forcing me to update my watch, which I don't want to do because every time I update my watch, I lose all of my activity. I don't know if this has happened to you, but for some reason, my activity just goes poof. So all my hard work from this whole year, just gone. So long story short, it's giving me the option to either update my watch, which I don't have enough storage to do, or reset my watch and delete everything. So. I'm at a crossroads. I'm not very happy about it. Sidebar, but I'm loving this NARS Orgasm X blush. It's so vibrant. Yes. I try not to do too much though because the one day I went overboard and it was like really blushy in your face. Yeah. That's a little bit much. You know what? Whatever. It's fine. I really wish I had a good profile or like jawline, but what can you do? I'm not God's favorite, and it's good to want things. That's what my parents always told me. So, next order of business to talk about. So, today I went for a walk, and it was an hour-long walk. It was just lovely. It's such a nice day out. Like, it's amazing how quickly it's transitioned to fall, hence why I'm so pale. I just haven't laid out in weeks because it just hasn't been warm enough. Anyways, I went for this walk, it was so nice, and I'm not, I don't know about any of you, but I'm not a big podcast person. Like, I just, I don't like podcasts. I just can't get into them. And I know there's a ton out there, and I'm sure, like, 
I could become a podcast gal if I found what I liked. I don't know. I see the appeal of them. Like, I totally understand why people like them. I just get really bored. Like, and unless it's, like, a topic I'm really interested in learning about or just listening to, I just don't care. I'd rather, like, jam out to music, you know? But I did listen to a podcast on my walk today. And I have to tell you, I didn't hate it. In fact, I quite enjoyed it, which is shocking. I've never mentioned it on my channel or in any of my videos, but I love Emma Chamberlain. Like, I love her videos. I love her as a person. Like, she is great. But anyways, she has a podcast, and it's called Anything Goes. And I love, like, I could just sit around and watch her videos for hours on end. Like, I just find her so entertaining, and, like, I don't know, I just could listen to her for hours. So... I gave her podcast a chance and I was very pleasantly surprised. Please don't come at me if this looks like garbage. <laughs> uh, yeah. But anyways, I just really like her podcast. I think that's why I was able to walk so long. Like eventually I'm just like over going for a walk and I'm like, yeah, I'll come back after two miles. I walked for four miles. I want to try and like get into podcasts. I'm going to start listening to hers, um, but maybe I'll dabble with a couple others. I don't know. Okay, this part, don't even watch. You don't even want to see this happening right now because <laughs> the technique is awful. I really should just use tape, but it's fine. The damage is done and we're going to live with the consequences. You know, it doesn't look, it does not look that bad. What other updates do I have for you guys? Um... Oh, I do have a job again. I mean, I don't have my job on the cruise ship um, as cruises are still at a standstill. Um, they're not able to, you know, do their thing yet. I'm hoping by 2021 I'll have a job being able to perform again because I miss it so much. But I am working part-time at the boutique I used to work at before I went for my contract. So... I've been working at this boutique for, I want to say almost three years. I did an internship with them, and then I started working there throughout college. So, yeah, I've really been enjoying that, and I need I can't even do my eyeliner on camera. Just wait one second. Twelve seconds later. This is why I rarely do eyeliner, because it never goes as planned, and it always turns out really bad. But, moving onwards... <laughs> I'm going to apply my lashes. What was I going to say though? I had something worth value to talk about. Oh, I remember what I was going to say. I just need structure in my life. Like, I've always had a crazy busy schedule. Like, since I was, you know, very young, I've always been running from thing to thing. And then especially in college because I wanted to do everything. So... I was juggling a lot of things at once. I was still training full-time, competing. Um, I had a job. I was recruitment chair for my sorority and I was super involved with that, plus a social life and I was in the honors program. So I had to keep up my GPA. I just had a lot going on. But I really thrive with having a very structured schedule. So now that I'm home and I just don't have that, I've been, you know, it's just been very weird for me and I don't know how to like fill my time. Anywho, ooh, that went better than expected, I will say. Again, long story short, it always takes me forever to explain anything, but I'm really happy to be working again and it has, you know, given me some sort of routine even though I'm not working full time. And I'm still skating, keeping up with my tricks. I'm just trying to like stay trained so that I'm ready to go when the time comes. Also, I don't know when I'm gonna be posting this. It might be like after the fact, but I am going to Long Island next weekend and I'm staying with Emily and I'm so excited. I did just see her like last month when we went camping at Marissa's like lake house or whatever, but that's my best friend and I'm so excited to see her. So we're gonna do all the fall things. Of course I'm gonna vlog, but I just don't know if it's gonna go up before or after this.
as I'm doing my brows, I'll just tell you, I'm currently in the process of like growing my brows out again because they like used to be really, really, really full. And I plucked them myself and over time, I guess I've just like plucked and plucked and plucked and plucked and didn't realize how thin they got. So I'm trying to grow them out. If you realize that they look a little janky, that's why, because I'm in that like awkward phase of them growing out very patchy. Another thing I'm really, really excited about for my fellow Grey's Anatomy lovers, season 17 is coming out very soon and I cannot contain my excitement. Also, The Bachelor is coming, well, Bachelorette, I should say, is airing in a couple weeks and I'm stoked, so excited. If there's anything you could take away from this video is that I look Grey's Anatomy. If you didn't know that about me already, now you do. My face is all done, I just have to put my lipstick on, so I'm going to use my typical red showgirl lip. And I haven't used this since my closing show. I probably should invest in some lip liner, but... Oh wow. <laughs> that is a statement. I can't really tell if that's even, but we're gonna go with it. Uh, hello world, I'm here. Lastly, we have to set our makeup. This is so incredibly extra for dinner, but ooh, it's fine. So now that the makeup is done, I'm gonna just quickly straighten the hair and put our little outfit on. The hair is done, the makeup's done. All that's left now is the outfit. So, I'm gonna take this little sweatshirt off and we're gonna put on a dress and heels because I'm that bitch. Here is the final look. I just put this dress on. It's from Nordstrom Rack, but it's originally from Topshop, I wanna say. And then I just have my Anna Luisa necklace on, Anna Luisa bracelet, and all my normal rings. So, love this look. And then I have these heels. These are from Nordstrom Rack as well, but they're Sam Edelman. And I think they're so cute. And they have beading on the back. If you can see that, they're just, oh, I love them. Okay, and then I have a leather jacket I'm just going to throw over this because it's a little chilly outside. So. Anyways, I'm going to end this video. Thank you so much for watching. My parents are yelling at me that I need to get downstairs because we're running late, but I hope you guys enjoyed and I will just see you in my next video. Bye guys.